All right, in this video, I'm gonna talk about two things I would like for you to do today, if you haven't already. So um, one is to get into the new advisory class that's been set up in uh, Google Classroom. So to get into it, you're gonna to go to my homepage in Clever, and then you're gonna scroll down to the advisory and office hours section, and you're gonna click on um, this Google Classroom icon and notice that there's a join code down here. It's YZ6PTJX. And I would write that down um, before you move on to this next step. Okay, once you have that written down, you're gonna go ahead and click on the Google Classroom icon. And you may have to go through a login stage, but once you get here, um, you should see this main screen, which is where all your classes show up. Um, the advisor class is already showing up for me, but I wanna show how to make it show up for you. So you're gonna go up to the plus sign in the upper right-hand corner, and this, and you're gonna pick join class, and then you're gonna be typing in uh, that code. So again, the code is YZ6PTJX. I already have it copied, so I'm gonna go ahead and paste it in here. And once you have the code in, you're gonna hit the join button, and then you'll be able to see this uh, tile show up. And this is your um, 10th grade advisory. And the reason I set this up is I wanted you to have a go-to place where you could find all the information about what we've been doing in advisory. And if there's anything that you need to hear about, um, if there are things that you should work on, um, it's all listed here. So for example, I have an announcement that I just posted that we won't be having regular advisory meetings this week. We're using the time for me to meet with you one-on-one -on -one to have a chance to say hi and to check in and see how things are going. And in here, there's a I, I'm letting you know that there's a take action section under classwork that's going to help you sign up for times to meet with me. Um, but let's go ahead and go to classwork and let's see what's in here. So there's three sections that I set up. Take action. These are things that you should do. A lot of these things you've probably already done. Um, the information survey, you've probably already done the elective adding form. Um, if you need to add or drop a class, you can go directly to that form. And then here's that sign up. I'm going to come back to that in a second. CVA Resources has links to Counseling, Synergy, the Clever website, and the CVA website. And then I have all of our past slideshows here that we've looked at during advisory. So if you need to review that or access any of the links in the slideshows, you can find them all there. But let me show you this really quick. So I wanna use our time this week for one-on-one -on -one check ins And so to get you there, one way you can do this is you can click on the sign up. And then down here, it tells you there's kind of two ways to sign up. And there's also a video showing you how to do this. Um, but if you go to this 10th grade advisory spreadsheet, this shows our advisories for this week. And I'm gonna let you know that this Friday we don't have school. So advisory won't happen on Friday, but it will be happening on Monday, Tuesday, and Thursday. So if one of these times works for us to check in, go ahead and click on one of the cells and go ahead and type in your first and last name. And you probably need to go up to this little box up here to add your first and last name. If for some reason none of these times work, or maybe by the time you get in here, they're all filled up, you can then go down here, and this takes you to the office hours scheduler that's set up for me. And because we're only doing 10 minute check-ins um, for this, I would suggest doing a 15 minute meeting with me. And you wanna try to find a 15 minute meeting that's available sometime in this next week. And I'm gonna take Friday off. So pick a 15 minute during one of these times and then you can go ahead and confirm name, email, uh, Zoom, or phone call. I think Zoom is best if that's possible. And um, just say in here that we're doing our quick one-on-one -on -one check in and you can put in your cell phone number so you get a text reminder. All right, I hope everything here is making sense. So again, the two things I wanna make sure that you do today if you haven't already done them is log in to the Google Classroom that's set up for advisory and make sure that you have written your name in this spreadsheet to let me know what time we're going to meet. Or if none of those times work or they're all full, 
go into Calendly, which is the scheduling place, and find a 15 minute meeting time that works for us this week. All right, please email me if you have any questions about doing any of these steps. Thanks, bye.